First of all, your name? Uh, Chief Jeff Johnston, Battalion Chief Woodlands Fire Department. Spell your last name? J-O-H-N-S-T-O-N. Tell me what you have. Uh, upon arrival, uh, Truck 108 had a uh, fire showing from the uh, first and second floor of the uh, of the complex. Um, they had heavy involvement uh, from the uh, on the balcony area and into the extended into the structure. Um, they had uh, personnel had already evacuated the uh, the apartment uh, of origin. Um, so they began hitting it from the outside and then moved to the inside once they uh, received water supply and, uh, and the personnel. Um, they got a good knockdown on the, on the first and uh, second floor. And uh, really after that, it was uh, just uh, chasing the smoke through the attic and keeping it out of the attic. Okay, common attic or a firewall between them? There's a firewall between, runs linear down the building, uh, and it contained the, contained the fire uh, and the smoke traveled to a large extent. Damage-wise, we have two apartments with major damage. What about smoke water? We have two units of major damage. We have some uh, water damage on the uh, Division C apartments that butt up to the uh, uh, fire apartments of origin, and we have some smoke damage uh, throughout uh, throughout the building. Okay. How many residents you pick in this building? Any idea? Or how many apartments total? There are. I believe there are 16, 16 apartments in this building. Power disconnected for the whole building. Power's disconnected the entire building. Uh, this time we uh, we had two transported, uh, two patients transported by Montgomery County Hospital District. Um, other than that, we've had refusals or uh, no patients at all. Smoke inhalation mainly or what? Are they injured? Uh, I believe it was probably a, a smoke inhala inhalation, yes, sir. All right. Appreciate it. All right. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. Wells. Ruben, Ruben, uh -huh. W-E-L-L-S? Yes, sir. Tell me what happened. You, you're in the apartment behind this, right? Yes, sir. Tell me what happened. I pulled up at around about 2 o'clock and uh, heard someone screaming, help, help, my kids, my kids. So I took out running, and I went to see what was happening, and I seen smoke. So that's when I kicked down the door, and then the fire started coming out. So I was like, it's too much fire, so I didn't want to go in that way. So I went to the balcony, and then... I took the bike and I busted out the balcony window and it was too much fire coming in there. So that's when I went to the kids window and I bust out the kids window and me and the mother went to grab the kids out the, uh, out the kids window. And that was it. And then we took out running, knocking on everybody's door around the apartment, all the neighbors trying to get them out to safety. The kids, they took them in for smoke inhalation? Yes, sir. But they how old them. were they? 
They was like maybe five and three. Boy and a girl, or boy and a girl. Boy and a girl. Okay. Mm -hmm. Which was the younger, the boy or the girl? Uh, the boy was the youngest. The boy was the youngest. Mm -hmm. How much fire was there? I mean, oh, yeah. it was a put, put it, put it, put a lot of fire. Now was that the bottom apartment? That was the bottom apartment. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Appreciate it. All right.